Hey guys, what's up? This is Jinx Rose, and welcome back to DOS is Dead. Today we are playing Zork, the Great Underground Empire, with me, Jinx Rose, and... K-Swag. I'm all excited. And you're like, my name is K-Swag. I don't know, dude, like, I, I I just was, like, totally pumped for Pokemon, and now we stopped playing Pokemon. <laughs> I want to play more Pokemon. Oh, we gotta get back to Pokemon. Well, I gotta play... catch me 150, even though I can't in a Nuzlocke. <laughs> All right, we are playing Zork One, the Great Underground Empire, and right now we are west of a house. All right, okay, guys, guys, don't worry. I know, I know you're probably thinking right now, why can't I hear the game sounds? Well, sorry to say, I don't think there's any sound for this game. There's no sound. There's no graphics. It's a text adventure. They're my favorite. You gotta think with your mind. Yeah, it's like use playing. your imagination. Imagination. <laughs> imagination. We're standing to the west of a house. You're standing in an open field west of a white house with a boarded front door. There's a small mailbox here. I'm gonna examine the mailbox. Uh, I don't know the word. Bleh. Okay. Type Open mailbox. Mailbox. Opening the small belt mailbox reveals a leaflet. Read Take. leaflet. Leaflet. Read leaflet. Zork is a game of adventure, danger, and low cunning. In it, you will explore some of the most amazing territory ever seen by mortals. No computer should be without one in 1983. Wait, 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 wait. In it, you will explore some of the most amazing... Wait, so should no computer be without Zork or without mortals? Both. I'm kind of confused by their, their jingo jango there. <laughs> jingo jango. Just how the jingo jango there kind of confusing me. Sorry if the mouse was there. Case I just moved it like a boss. Um, like a what boss? What are we doing? Like a boss. Um, Look around. Look around. And it's going to be like, I don't know the word around. Oh, wow. You are standing in the open field west of a wet. With a boarded front door. Enter, uh, enter house? Enter house. I can't see how to get in from here. We're going to go west. This is a forest with trees in all directions. To the east, there appears to be sunlight. We're going to go east. What? Running through <laughs> a dimly lit forest. The path heads north-south here. Uh, large tree with some low branches stands at the end of the path. <laughs> wait a minute, wait a minute. We went west from the house and entered the forest. Then we went east, which was back to the house, but somehow ended up in another forest path. And now we can only go north and south, apparently. Oh, I know what's going on, dude. We're high. We're, okay. We've got to be high. Our character in this game. This is a dimly lit forest with large trees all around. You hear in the distance the chirping of a song. Dude, 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 time kill bird. What do you want to kill? The kill bird with my mind. Didn't work. Let's see what's in our inventory really quickly. We have a leaflet. We're going to drop the leaflet. Okay, here's my question. Yes. Um, okay, I forgot it. So, oh, no, impossible. I remember now, I remember now. Sh sh should I start, like, fucking, like, mapping out the world of Zork while we're doing this? No. You're in a clearing with a I forest get running lost. on all sides. A path leads south. On the ground is a pile of leaves. Examine pile of leaves. And it's going to be like, what is the word exam? Oh, there's nothing special about them. Uh, burn pile of leaves. Oh, we don't have anything to burn it with yet. No, we, uh, have, we have nothing. We suck. North. The forest becomes impenetrable to the north. Okay, south. And south again. You're facing the north side of a white house. There is no door here, and all the windows are boarded up. To the north, a narrow path winds through the trees. So we should go east, not east to south. You're behind the white house. A path leads into the forest to the east. In one corner of the house, there's a small window, which is slightly ajar. Open window, even though ajar means open. With great effort, you open the window far enough to allow entry. Enter house. Kitchen. You're in the kitchen of the white house. A table seems to have been used recently for the presentation of food. A Preparation, dude. What did I say? Presentation. Okay. Preparation <laughs> of food. A passage leads to the west, and a dark staircase can be seen leading upward. A dark chimney leads down. Everything is dark. Down, and to the east is a small window which is open. On the table is an elongated brown sack smelling of hot peppers. A bottle is sitting on the table. The glass bottle contains a quantity of water. Take water. Take bottle. Got it. Take Bag? Sack? Take sa sack. Taken. Open sack. Reveals a lunch and a clove of garlic. Eat lunch. Thank you very much. It really hit the spot. Eat garlic. No, we gotta save it for vampires, dude. Oh, okay. Sorry. Yeah, 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 yeah I think more. Yeah, we have to save it for vampires. Strategic degree. Strategic right here, dude. <laughs> uh, examine chimney. 
chimney leads downward and looks climbable. So if we look again really quickly, uh, we have a passage to the west and a dark star <laughs> staircase that leads up and a chimney that leads down. Let's go up first. Okay. Let's like... go up. You have moved into a dark place. It is pitch black. You were likely to be eaten by a Groot. Down. Go down. And then down again. Only Santa Claus climbs down chimneys. Ha <laughs> ha. 1980s humor up. No, damn it. Down. Uh, west. <laughs> You're in the living room. There's a I door. love this. You're like... <laughs> Damn! Oh, Santa Claus! We're going back upstairs where we got eaten by a Gru! <laughs> Question, what's what a Gru? Hold on, hold on, wait. Oh, we're going to go back east to the kitchen, and we're going to go up, and we're going to say, what is a Gru? The Gru is a sinister, lurking presence in the dark places of the Earth. Its favorite diet is adventures, but its insatiable appetite is tempted by its fear of light. Tempered by its fear of light. No Gru has ever been seen by the light of day, and few have survived its fearsome jaws to tail the tail. So we want to go back down so we don't get eaten by that. Now we're going to go west. Now we're in the... Why is there a Gru in a house? I don't know. Uh, look. Wait, 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 wait. There we go. Wait, 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 wait. No, go... Wait, living room. There's a sword. Yeah, no. Uh, because we'd already been in here, they gave us a brief description, so I had to look again. You're in the living room. There's a doorway to the east, a wooden door with a strange with strange gothic lettering to the west, which appears to be nailed shut, a trophy case, and a large oriental rug in the center of the room. Above the trophy case hangs an elvish sword of great antiquity. A battery-powered brass lantern is on the trophy. Take lantern. Yeah. I mean, we, I mean, kill the brew. Uh, Take sword. Examine lantern really quickly. I want to see if we have to. The lamp is turned off. Cool. So we can turn it on. Yeah. Take sword examine sword. I know I'm using up extra turns, guys, but I don't... I don't Okay, hey, turn... Uh, turn lamp on. We don't need it in this room. Okay, well then go... Oh, we want to open case. It's open. Examine case. The trophy case is in... Well, what the hell? We just jacked everything out of it. Uh, a door to the east, which is where we came from. A wooden door was strained, and it's nailed shut. A trophy and case. And oriental rug. Examine oriental rug. Nothing special. Take rug. It's extremely heavy and cannot be... Ca okay. Yeah, dumbass. <laughs> Just can't take a rug. Dumbass. Uh, turn on lamp. Okay, now we go up. This is the attic. The only exit is a stairway leading down. A large coil of rope is lying in the corner. On a table is a nasty-looking knife. Examine knife. Nothing. Okay, take knife. Because I have a feeling... Take rope. Yeah, that's going to get us this, down... This is D&D. It's gonna get us down to the basement. I have a feeling that the antiqu antiquated sword is gonna like break the minute we try to use it. So I'm gonna take the nasty looking knife. This is nasty. N nasty. It's nasty. 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 We're gonna go down and we're gonna turn off lamp. Actually, we should keep the lamp on. Yeah, we should leave it on because we're gonna go down to the basement. So we're gonna go. Uh, no, no, no. Use. Come on. Use rope on chimney. I don't know the word use. Put rope in chimney almost every text adventure game you can't, you can't do, do that, that. Uh, uh, down only Santa Claus climbs down I'm not trying to climb down put down climb down chimney see what happens I just try it again just climb try again. down chimney climb down chimney with rope oh god that sentence isn't one I recognize damn it uh, where else have we not gone? Outside. Passage leads to the west of the dark. I don't get lost in the forest again. Dark chimney leads down. We want to go down the dark chimney. I mean, we, we, we <laughs> haven't found any like, grump get gru themed yet. I want to kill something. That's true. Let's go up. There's a table here. Good. I want to turn off the lamp. And attack gru with knife. I've known strange people, but fighting a lurking Gru? Fine, turn on lamp. And now, there's no... Gru. Gru. Okay, we're going to go back down again. How, what, how do we use the rope? Let me look again. What can we attach the rope to? Table? Let's examine the table. Wait, wait, wait. wait. A bachelor leaves east and the dark staircase can be seen leading... Oh, upward. that's the upward. Yeah. Never mind. Uh, I'm going to examine the table just really quickly. I was thinking there's like a secret staircase or something. Uh, uh, wrap rope around. Around. Around table. Okay. Uh, Use rope or rope. Info. Okay. Help. 
Nope. Nope, it doesn't know any of the basic control. <laughs> uh, yeah, we're kind of screwed. Put rope on table. Done. So the rope is now sitting on the table. Not what I wanted. Take rope. Examine rope. It's going to just be like, there's nothing special about the rope. Sorry, guys. We're completely 100% lost. Table seems to have no, been used. Right? <laughs> no, we're not. Case we're totally <laughs> not looking up a, a FAQ <laughs> right now. <laughs> there's nothing sinister happening in the background case <laughs> wag and an iphone and a guide uh passage leads to the west i'm gonna go back to the west and i want to examine door examine west door what about what about the weird sigils on this uh <laughs> the engravings translate to this space intentionally left blank what really that's hilarious uh unlock no we can't unlock it because it's nailed shut uh, let's go west. Doors nailed shut. I figured. East into the kitchen. East out of the house. South. You're facing the south side of a white house. There's no door here and all the windows are boarded. Okay. North again. Windows are all boarded. And then... West. Oh, there's a small mail. No, this is the... Uh-oh. South. Look. I gotta find the way back in. No door here and all the windows are barred. So we're going to go east. We're behind the house and I got to look again. Uh, which is open. Okay. Enter house. <laughs> Dude, I don't like. I just the, almost got us lost completely. Well, well, it's, it's telling me, like, I love the FAQ because it's like, from where you start out at the beginning of the game, just go north twice and you'll get to a place and you'll get an egg. But don't drop the egg or the game just, you're done. What? You can't beat the game. You can't beat the game if you drop the egg. On the tree, I guess. Perfect. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> well, let's get the egg then. Let's and let's exit again. We're gonna go west. No, east. Exit house. You can't see any house here. What? <laughs> go east. We're behind the house. Uh, if we go south, we're south of the house. And if we look, face this. There's no door here, and all the windows are barred. Uh, we go, go south again. No. No. We go north. Now we're in a clearing. Great. North. Great. We're lost. We're lost in the forest. West. South. We're lost. We're so lost. No, okay. We're north of the house. So we go north again? No, no. Look, 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 look around now. There. No. Uh, there's no door here and all the windows are boarded up. To the north, a narrow path winds through the trees. Is that something? Yeah, let's just fuck it. Let's go north. All right, we're going north. Forest path. We're going to look. A tree with some low branches. Stands at the end. So we're going to examine tree. Because it has low branches. What? Go north again. North again. Clearing. On the ground is a pile of leaves. North again. The forest becomes impenetrable. So, south. It's got to be... Damn it. North again. It's got to well, be well, you need to get to the front of the house. You need, you, need get, you, need north, you need to get on the side of the house again. That was... You can see the door. But it's... Uh, this particularly large tree with some low branches. Let's examine the low branches instead of the tree. I don't know. Examine branches. Examine branches. Then. I love how like, it, does, it doesn't... Know Nothing that. special. Great. Awesome. Let's get back in the house. <laughs> uh, is it south that I have to go? The windows are all boarded, so we're going to go north and then west. Nope. Oh my god, we're so lost again. East. North. North. Come on. In the distance, you hear the chirping of a songbird. We've been here. So we want to go west a bunch. Can you look to the house? Whoa! You would need a machete to go through. I thought it said I found a machete. That'd be awesome. Uh, uh, pile of leaves. So we go south from there, right? Yeah. It doesn't south make... Again. Okay, north of the house. So we look... No, 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 don't worry about this. Okay, we're at the house, right? North. Yes. Go we're west. North of house. Then we get lost in the forest. No, we're in the west of the house where the small mailbox is. Now go north. Go north twice. Okay. North of house. Oh, fuck this game. North. <laughs> Forest path. We're going to look again. Yeah, this is where it said. What, what do we do? Mystery, I've got a guide. Well, it says, like, okay, start from the house. Go north, north. You get egg. Get, okay, well, get egg. There's no wait, egg wait. here. Cl click U for up. What? 
You're about ten feet above the ground, nestled among some large branches. The nearest branch above you is above your reach. Beside you on the branch is a small bird's nest. In the bird's nest is a large egg encrusted with precious jewels, apparently scavenged by a childless songbird. The egg is covered with fine gold inlay and ornamented in lapis lazuli and mother of pearl. Unlike most eggs, this one is hinged and closed with a delicate looking clasp. The egg appears extremely fragile. Take egg. Can I open the egg? No, no, no. Don't open the egg? I open the egg. You have neither the tools or the expertise. So we're going to go back south to the house. Can I, go, can I go down? Down? Oh, yeah, down. Duh. It's like you try to go south and fall out of the tree. No, you're going to go south. North of the house. Okay. Okay, serving We've equipment. moved 144 times so far. We'll need the garlic later. Thank God you didn't eat the garlic. <laughs> yeah. That would have screwed us <laughs> over. Leave it now. <laughs> Open case. Oh, get back in the house. I don't know how. Get back to the north side of the house. I'm on the north side of the house. This is the one with it all boarded up. Now, go south. now if I go east. Okay, go east. Behind the house. Look. Uh, is open. Okay, enter house. Now we go Now go west. back into the kitchen, the living room. Now, move rug. Move rug. That's awesome. With great effort, the rug is moved to one side of the room, revealing the dusty cover of a closed trap door. Perfect. Perfect. Yeah, open trap door. Open trap door. The door reluctantly opens to reveal a rickety staircase descending into, into darkness. Turn on lamp. Lamp is already on. Good. Down. Cellar. You're in a dark and damp cellar with a narrow passageway leading north and a crawlway to the south. On the west is the bottom of a steep metal ramp which is unclimbable. Your sword is glowing with a faint blue glow. Yeah. There's a GRU. Okay, so a crawlway to the south, a uh, damp cellar with a narrow passageway leading north. So we can go north or south? Go north. Alright. The Troll Room. This is a small room with passages to the east and south and a forbidding hole leading west. Blood stains and deep scratches, perhaps made by an axe, mar the walls. A nasty-looking troll brandishing a bloody axe blocks all passages out of the room. The sword has begun to glow very brightly. Okay, now, uh... Kill. Attack troll with sword. Attack troll with sword. Your sword misses the troll by an inch. The troll swings. The blade turns on your armor, but it crashes broadside in your head. Since when do we have armor? I checked our inventory. We're naked. Uh, attack him again? Yeah. Attack troll with sword. You're still recovering from that last blow, so your attack is ineffective. The troll swings his axe, and it nicks your arm as you dodge. Jeez. Dude, we're getting our asses kicked. Yeah. It, it, it says to attack troll until he dies. He's a clumsy fighter. Your sword crashes down, knocking the troll into dreamland. Attack him again. I don't care. I, I'm gonna merc, merc, mercilessly. There we go. I couldn't come up with the freaking word. The unarmed troll cannot defend himself. He dies. Almost as soon as the troll breathes his last breath, a cloud of sinister black fog envelops him, and when the fog lifts, the carcass has disappeared. Your sword is no longer glowing. Sweet. Okay, so we want to look around the room really quickly. So, a small room with passage to the east and south. We came from the south, and a forbidding hole leading west. Uh, a bloody axe. We're gonna take the axe. Okay, type, too heavy. type in diagnose. To check our health. You have a light wound, which will be cured after 26 moves. You can be killed by one more light wound. Jesus! Yeah, we're kind of hurting. It's an interesting thing, though. You actually can see how you're doing. Mm-hmm. Kind of smart. Okay. We could waste 26 moves or just be really careful. So we probably don't want to go west through the forbidding hole. Do you want to go back into the basement? Oh, wait, wait. So it says, after the fight, which will come shortly, drop the sword. You don't need it anymore, and you can disregard the troll's axe as well. Then you go west. Oh boy, amaze, what a delight. You did remember to save after beating the troll, right? Oh yeah, I Incidentally, should Incidentally, the thief will probably show up the first time <laughs> while you're in the maze. Don't worry if he robs you. In fact, it's exactly what you want. If he sizes you up, give egg. That's right. Let him have it. And leave the area post haste. If he doesn't show up, restore the and go through the maze again. Or just wait until he appears. Okay. I don't want to go through the maze yet. I want to search the house. I'm going to go back south. Mm -hmm. Actually, uh, what's in this room right now? Nothing but his axe. And then we can go east and south. What's east? East-west passage. This is the narrow east-west passageway. There's a narrow stairway leading down at the north end of the room. It's leading down further than the basement? Yeah, we're going to hell, boy. We're going to hell, boy. All right, this is the troll room. We're going to go back south. 
and we're in the cellar. And that, I think, is going to be it for this episode. I hope you guys are enjoying this. I know it's a text adventure game, and I know a lot of you probably aren't into this, but I'm having fun. I hope k is having fun, too. <laughs> Although he wants to get back to Perkmer. So we will see you guys in the next episode.